Hello and welcome back to Darkwood. Here we are on day 12. Uh, yep, 12 days of Darkwood. Um, slightly less pleasant than 12 days of Christmas, if you ask me, but hey, you know, that's fine. We're, we're, we're getting through it. We're slowly but surely making our way through chapter one. Uh, we've got a few things we need to do. I believe there's a tank wreck that we discovered in the last episode that we cleared out some savages, but we still have a few that we need to take care of. Uh, also, I think I made a lockpick because there's a box out there somewhere that I need to acquire. Uh, we did increase our uh, hotbar by one, which is going to be super useful. Uh, we kind of hit the jackpot on loot last episode, so uh, that's pretty fantastic. I do like that quite a bit. And uh, we also have a we got lots of staves. We've got we've got the shovel, which we'll have to repair at some point in the near future. And we've got a full inventory here. Um, so I'm trying to figure out how I can start clearing this out. But for the time being, uh, we'll have to. The one thing though is the shovel. I think it's heavy. Okay, so this this is sharpened. So let's take a look at upgrading it. Yeah, it has sharpened. So. Okay, yeah, I remember now. So I bought the uh, the pipe there with the intention of upgrading the durability, but obviously we're short, actually pretty short on uh, scrap metal. So we're gonna have to keep an eye out for anything scrap metal related. But I think for now we uh, we're pretty much set. Uh, I did get quite a few comments and a lot of interesting things that I've discovered. Thanks very much for that. I uh, always appreciate a good comment with some tips. And I believe one of them was, yeah, so you can repair these wardrobes. I didn't realize that. Uh, it might be something I do at some point. I don't necessarily need it here because this is barricaded, but I don't know. Um, cool. All right, well, let's kick off this expedition and see if we can't get to the village, or at least nearby. And yeah, we'll stick with the trusty staff for now. It's been pretty good. So far. Uh, where are we? I actually passed it. I believe it was by the shrine, wasn't it? Uh, so there's a dog. There's a dog and... Is it north? Yeah, here it is. Search that, and then this was the crate that was locked that we needed to unlock. Empty bottle, matchsticks, and a flare. I think flares are pretty useful, but I'm not sure. I haven't used them yet. They seem pretty good. Uh, but I do have a few of them. I don't know, maybe I need to crack them. I'm just not sure what situation you would use a flare in. I did clean that guy out. Good. Perfect. I mean, maybe if you're in the middle of the night and you're getting, I don't know, does it like do anything to distract monsters or I do not know. Eventually we'll find out. Might just use it and figure out what we have. First hand experience. It's, uh, I'm a hands-on guy. That's what I like. Oh, crap. Yep. You're definitely not happy with me. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Don't mess with that guy. I mean, I didn't want to mess with him, but he just pops up everywhere. It seems like every time I turn around, there's this freaking giant antlered demon wanting to kill me. Alright, so there's, there's the wolf, and that means we're getting pretty close. Oh, hey, wait. Is this the dog I killed? It is, and I get the meat is still fresh-ish. I mean, good enough. Okay, here we go. This is what I was looking for. Uh, so we killed this guy. Oh, we didn't take his staff, so let's do that. I believe we got... yeah. There's more, though. There's plenty more where that came from, I'm sure. There's... Yeah, here we go. Can I sneak up on him? 
I can. Wow. <laughs> I didn't expect that to work. Right in the face. I got another one for you right here. Yep. There you go. Keep it coming. There we go. How about one more? One more? There we go. Excellent. And another stick, because why not? Alcohol. Got lots of alcohol. Should probably start using it for stuff. A wreck of a World War II tank. So I suppose salvaging this is out of the question. Uh, corpse. Hey. Can be used as a melee weapon or thrown. Interesting. Whoa, hey, fabric. <laughs> Am I seeing things? Am I hallucinating right now? I, I swear, I just got a piece of fabric, and here's another one. You gotta be kidding me, game. Holy crap. I mean, this knife is cool and all, but fabric? Yes, please. Yes. Yes. I'll take as many slabs of fabric as you're willing to give me. And I'd like to take this battery, but I'm not gonna be able to. Wow, that's awesome. That's awesome because I think uh, the next upgrade I'm going to do is to the inventory. Get another couple of slots there. That's going to be huge. Two more things I can squirrel away while I'm out looking for stuff. That's well worth it. And I only had to kill three savages to get it. That's a walk in the park. Alright, well we are full, which means we got to go back. But let's just see if we can't... Yeah, road to the village. That's what I'm looking for. Is that like a separate area? Also, there's a road here. I think this is the first road I've seen. Alright, well... If the village is a separate area, I do want to go there, but not yet. Not quite yet. I would like to unload and increase my inventories. Uh-oh. I know what that is. That's one of those choppers, isn't it? You should be sleeping though, right? No. What the frick? Oh god. Nope, nope. Switch, switch, switch. Uh, what the? F <laughs> I. <laughs> okay. Well, he exploded. Dead Mushroom Man. Is that him making that noise? Yeah, that was a explosion of gore. Odd meat. Is that the same as this? Yeah. Wow. I think that's an arm. A couple of legs, another arm, some chunks of torso. <laughs> okay. Uh, wasn't expecting that, but... Alright. Cool. Nice to meet you, Mushroom Man. Wow, that's cool. That is very cool. Does that mean there's more in here? I don't think I'm... Alright, let's 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 go back. I think it's time. It's time to make use of this fabric. Now, I do definitely want to use this fabric, but at the same time, I'm running out of string, and I believe string is used in both those upgrades. So we'll have to check out the uh, trader fellow to see if he has any because I might I mean if I got fabric and didn't have any string to make use of it that'd be a sad day although we could also check this guy he sells this stuff doesn't he hey how's it going buddy um, yeah let's just do this he does not have any string. That is unfortunate. He does have a chain, though, so that's cool. I don't know what that's used for, but... Uh, nothing here particularly interesting. Nothing that I'd want to buy. He does have another metal pipe, though, if I needed that for whatever reason. Holy cow, this is worth a hundred? I wonder how much damage it does. Alright, well, you don't have what I want, so I guess I'll see you later. 
Watch out for the poison shrooms. Don't get poisoned, please. Alright. Yeah, Peter's a guy that we're gonna have to visit again because he had, uh... He, it sounded like he needed some stuff for his... for his awesome spaceship that's totally gonna fly. But he was kind of vague about it, and I wasn't sure if he was, like, saying that because I could do something for him, or if he was just making idle conversation. It's hard for me to tell, sometimes. Alright, let's get back here. And... I think we've got plenty of time. I think Dark is at... Or is in... Seven hours? Thereabouts? So we do have time. It might be worth it to actually go in and take a peek at the village. However, what we're going to need to do... Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yeah, there's our last rope. But it's totally worth it. Totally worth it. Awesome. Awesome. All right. So the question is, what do we do with his knife? I don't know what to, what to do with it. I think I'm going to dump this gasoline into whatever we have space for. Uh, I can stack the alcohol. I still have these staves. I can stack that. I can stack that. Oh, those go higher than five. That's good. What about the bottle? No. No. This requires gasoline. So I could make Molotovs from... I, since I have a lot of gas, I can use those empty bottles and the gasoline for that. And then there's this, which I'm not really sure what that icon is. Yeah, I really hate it when it makes noises. Mm, I'm not sure about this one. What do I do with it? What do I do with it? Oh, we've got a lot of pills, too. Should probably start using them. Ah, uh, Three? That's what you stack to? You disappoint me. All right, well, let's hurry up here while we have daylight. 418 out of 800. All right, so we're halfway there. If we're going to, ah, uh, this, this is not good. And I really need some metal scraps, but if we're gonna go to the, uh, the village. All right, I think I'll do this. I think I'll do this. If we're gonna go to the village though. I feel like it might be my best interest to repair this up. So that's what I'll do. And I need more places to store things. I can't store anything in here, can I? No, because it's just a table. And that's full. I have even more empty bottles. Um, what about here? Is it smart to put things here? Are they going to stay there? Hopefully, maybe. I don't know. This might be a little bit too much min-maxing, but let's go ahead and do this. Because I think there was an open slot for it. Yeah. Alright, let's get rid of this gasoline. Oops. Keep that kind of there, I guess. Good enough. Alright, so first off, let's check this. And yeah, we've got lots of gas in there. Yeah, we've got lots of gas in pretty much everything, so... Let's top this off. And top this off. I mean, I know eventually we're probably going to move. You know, to a new hideout. So, I don't want to use up too much gas. But six full tanks is a lot. Especially if we keep getting some. You know, I have a stream of it coming in. Alright. Let's go to... What will we do? I think it's worth it to continue our counterclockwise exploration pattern. Uh, hopefully it's not too late though. It's getting six, I think, 1600 hours. I think that means, what do we want? Maybe like an hour and a half to get back, so. Wait, what? 
I mean, I, how did I miss this? Where are we? We're east of the bug area. All right, so here's what we'll do. Go, because I think I do have enough wire for that. So let's do that. Open that up. That should get us close enough tonight. Still haven't visited the village, but I want to make sure that we uh, clean up here, because I'm sure that that... Uh, the loot so far has been very, very good, very useful, so... We will be prepared, if nothing else. The one thing that I'm going to have to stop doing, though, is making all those bear traps. Like, I just can't afford to, uh, can't afford to do that, unfortunately. Like, I'm really low on scrap metal, so... And I haven't been finding those tricky bear traps out in the wild. I was kind of hoping I'd find more of those, but it has not happened. Alright, so over to the bug area. Yeah. Down here, I think. I said southeast, right? So over here, yeah, here we go. Perfect. All right, crate. What do you got for me? Some wire, some flares, some matches, alcohol, and I hate that noise. All right, well, let's go. This is Peter's place. Let's go north a little bit because we're quickly running out of time. What is this? Nothing, I guess. Poison mushrooms, I know, but... So we haven't done too much exploration to the north here. Oh, more bug mounds. I'm gonna leave that wood there for now. We've got so many wooden logs that we can burn through. Yeah, ooh, there's a dog. There is a dog. All right. That was a huge miss. There we go. All right, that works. I'm not going to grab that just yet. All right, so are we at the top here? I think we are. Nope, not quite. There's one of those twitching corpse things. Disarm? Yeah, that didn't work at all. <laughs> now my vision is blurred. Ah, oh, this is just... nothing good came of that. I should probably just leave those alone. I felt like, you know, disarm actually meant disarm, though. Ooh. That's not what I want to hear. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's heal up. And let's get ourselves set up here. Alright, well, this is going to be a night that I'm going to not use... A bear trap. Because honestly, I don't really have much of a choice. Got plenty of planks. Should we grab some out of there? Yeah, we've got some nails here. Let's do that. Okay. Uh, what do we want to do here? Mm hmm... Let's make another bandage while we're thinking about it. And I guess we'll grab these nails. And we'll have these boards handy. Put that away. Let's keep these flares on hand. Put that away so we have enough for an extra if we need it. Keep some pills on hand for the quick healing. 
And yeah, I think that's good. So let's go ahead and turn the generator on. And I, I've been contemplating what to do here because we can repair this doorway, right, and blockade it. We could blockade that, but the problem with that is we don't have enough lights to go around the whole house, so. I think we're just going to have to uh, leave it at that. Now, we could repair this and blockade it as well. But, I don't know. I mean, we certainly have enough resources for it. Uh, I don't know. Problem is then we'd have to use this front door every time. All right. Is that me? Okay. Flickering lights, as per usual. Okay, I can hear something out there. I'm really concerned about this. I really am not happy about that. I don't know though, like I can't sustain bear traps. In fact, I, I may have already used too many. Hmm. Oh, it's getting dark in here. What's going on? What is that noise? Some kind of clicking? Now I hear nothing, of course. Oh, there we go. Some savages. Okay. It's gotta be up in here. Oh man, I hope nobody comes through here. What, already? Get out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is taking... It's taking a while. One more. Right in the noggin. Alright, let's swap out a staff. Let's get up here and quickly barricade this. Alright, good. Should probably... Oh. Nah, crap. <laughs> What are you doing? You're already inside. Why are you smacking barricades, you dipstick? Take that, huh? Yeah. Uh-oh, uh-oh. What is that? What is that? I'm pulling out the shovel. What is that? That's new. That's new. Oh no, oh no. Why did the light go out? Can I turn it back on? Nope, I sure can't. What is that noise? I'm hearing things. Oh, thank you. Yep, I'm definitely hearing things. No, what the frick is that? That's... What is going on? 
Something is lurking in the shadows. I should stay close to the light. Yeah, no freaking kidding. If the light would stay on. Oh no. No, we're fine. We're fine. Come on, Dawn has to show up here any second now. Okay. Nothing else? Now oh, the light's back on. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Oh man, that was, uh, yeah, the game is definitely kicking it up a notch. I don't know what that was, and I don't want to know. It was like an earthquake of some sort, and then the light went out, and then it came back on. I don't know, man. Let's just keep an eye on things. So there are windows that they love to attack, and there are windows that they just don't care about. I also like... Can I? No, I can only dismantle that. That kind of sucks, actually. I was kind of hoping I could repair it. Yeah, okay. Alright, well. Hey, you know what? We made it through the night. I, I really don't know what the implications of what happened are, but I guess we'll, we'll have to wait and see. Cool. Oh, we don't have anything there that we need. Let's talk to this guy. How's it going? Nothing new for me, I see. All right, did you have string? You did not have string. But you, I have a lot of reputation with you because I didn't buy anything, so that's, oh man, that's interesting. It's very interesting. What would I do? If I bought the handgun for him, I could make a gun, but like a small caliber pistol. Not sure about that though. Like I haven't encountered anything that, well, aside from the chompers, like those guys could probably use a couple of bullets, but since bullets are pretty scarce, uh, and the red chompers are kind of also pretty scarce, I just know that the further we get into the game, the more important that's going to be, and I kind of want to save the ammo, so... Let's go ahead and get rid of this, because we don't need it. Mm. This knife sells for a lot, but I don't know. I've got lots of rep, and... What can I buy? What should I buy, more importantly? Scrap metal. I think scrap metal is the order of the day we are very low and if he gets a refill on the scrap metal that'll be even better and we could get some uh some of this action but i i don't know not yet we'll just put it that way anything else while we're here anything else we don't need wires we certainly don't need boards we're pretty good on healing still don't know what pills are used for there's the fabric, obviously. We've already got a watch. Yeah, I think we're good. Might need nails at some point in the future, but let's uh, offset the cost of this a little bit by, I've got tons of alcohol. I don't know if it's a good idea to start selling this stuff, but we've got so many bottles. I think I'll just sell those so that we don't necessarily, actually, if I do that, we'll go down to a perfect 450, just in case we need it. Excellent. Thank you, kind sir. I am appreciative of your donation to the cause. Now, does that mean I have enough? Or did I need eight? I think I needed eight. Man. Game, give me some scrap metal, please. I'm doing the work. Okay, so we have nails. Where did the nails go? We have lots of boards. We've got lots of inventory space. Which is good. Uh, do we need two types of healing? Probably not. I mean, the only reason... Uh, I mean, I don't want to use them... Yet. I feel like they're going to be very 
necessary later on in the game. And I'm still going to hang on to this for the time being. I don't know. I should probably get rid of it, but we'll keep it for now. We'll probably end up selling it at some point for rep. But... Small caliber magazine. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. All right. Um, what can we upgrade? Just these two items? Nothing else? All right, fine. Oh, you know what? I wasn't even thinking. Should probably go turn off the the good old generator. Yeah, oh, that's not bad. Plenty of fuel. No, I'm not in danger of running out of fuel at any point. Cool. All right. Well, I think that's uh, gonna bring this episode to an end. Uh, we've got another managed to clear out the tank and discover another piece of fabric, which is amazing. So we've got lots of inventory space now, and I'm pretty happy about that. We're low on scrap metal, so we're going to keep an eye out for that. Otherwise, I think we're going to hopefully eventually get ourselves into the village and see what's going on there. Anyways, thanks so much for watching this episode, and join me next time.